I'm here in London. I don't get to hang out with Lewis Hamilton very often. So if you got the opportunity, you definitely take it up. So we're gonna rock across town, meet up with my boat, and I'm looking forward to showing them around and hanging out. I first met Lewis in Monaco in 2005, and I introduced myself to Lewis. I said, what do you do, Lewis? He said, oh, I race in Formula 3. I said, wow, how are you doing? He said, well, I'm leading the championship. And I said, amazing. I said, you'll be in Formula 1 soon, won't you? He said, well, I hope so. That's the plan. Lewis exudes confidence. I see somebody who's as focused, if not more focused, than he's ever been. How you doing, man? Yeah, good. You good? Typical. It was nice this morning, wasn't no, it? No. Typical English weather. Come on, let's go on board and have a look. That's awesome. The well, last time we spent some time together, really, was 2008 on that round the Isle of Wight race. Yeah, I know. Remember well, that? Of course I remember. <laughs> we had a crash. I felt sorry for you the next day. All the papers, Hamilton, crashes again. And it was me <laughs> who was you, driving. I know. <laughs> I need some advice from you. <laughs> no, you don't know at all. You're killing it, man. I feel like on the water, you can get away from everything. As soon as you go out of sight of land, you know how small you are as a human being. Yeah. And that's a real humbling experience. Yeah, I bet, yeah. This is one of my favorite boats. And believe it or not, we've got 500 horse on it. Do you, do you want to have a drive? Yeah, I'd love to. Is that, is that OK? Yeah. Hold on. Ah, oh, never been under the bridge before, that's pretty cool. Right now, it's all about the fine details, those extra millimetres and milliseconds, and that's what I exist to race for. And I'm just like you, man, you always wanted to push the limits and rise above the rest. So what do you think of that, Lewis? That was great fun, man. Great fun. Thanks for letting me ride and show me around the boat. What's really different now is, you know, being 32, you're feeling it more on the body. My neck, for example, that takes a beating. Racing drivers, it's all about that belief in yourself and having that confidence in your own ability. When you get in that car, there's not a split second that I'm questioning anything. You've got to have that belief in yourself, haven't you? Well, thanks again. I'll see you safe, man. Take care.